Come check this out. What is it? Some guy took a ping pong ball, put a hole in it, and then dipped it in liquid nitrogen. It just starts spinning around really fast. Oh, cool. All right, put on your shoes. <laughs> put on your shoes. We're leaving now. <laughs> we need to do this. <laughs> Let's see if this works. So before we get started, I think we should get a baseline to see how fast I can spin the ping pong ball by hand. So what I did is I drew a little arrow and a band on it, and we can use the high-speed camera to tell how many times this spins per second. All right, three, two, one, go. Now let's analyze the high-speed video. My camera takes 960 frames per second, and the ping pong ball completes one revolution in 20 frames. That means the ping pong ball is spinning 48 times per second, or 2,880 revolutions per minute. Now I'm poking a diagonal hole into the ball, so when the expanding gases escape, it'll make the ball spin in a circle. So when I twist the valve, liquid propane comes out of the tank, and it should act like liquid nitrogen because it boils at negative 40 degrees Fahrenheit. I attached a thin syringe needle to the end of the tube, and I use it to directly fill the ping pong ball with propane. In three, two, one. That was pretty cool. Wow. As soon as I let the ping pong ball out of my hand, it starts spooling up, and initially it's not spinning much faster than I could have done myself. But within a fraction of a second, the ping pong ball is spinning so fast my camera can only pick up two frames per revolution. So by using the same formula that we did for when I spun it by hand, we can figure out that this thing was spinning about 10 times faster, or 28,800 RPM, but I actually think it's spinning faster because when you look at the ball spinning, it actually advances a little bit each time, and the person who originally posted it on Reddit thought it was spinning about 10,000 times, so three times faster than that. I can't believe that that little ping pong ball could spin 30,000 times in one minute. That's, you know, 600 times per second. That's pretty crazy. Um, well, that's it for this week's video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you guys next time. Bye. So if you like this video, go ahead and give me a thumbs up, and I've included some bloopers and outtakes of stuff that didn't make it into the video or stuff that didn't work, so keep watching. I also bought tennis balls and racquetballs to try this out with, but they're just too heavy to get up to any appreciable speed. Originally, I tried just dunking the ping pong ball in liquid propane like I saw the guy do with liquid nitrogen, but that just didn't work. And also, I tried putting two holes in the ping pong ball, which also didn't work. It's not really working, is it? Because propane boils at such a low temperature, it's kind of the same like liquid nitrogen. It can also freeze stuff, like this flower. Whoa. Oh, it's still going. Duffy, are you playing in dirt? Are you being, are you being a bad dog? <laughs>